Hi, I'm John Emmett. It's the final day of the Laser World Championships and I have a very happy man beside me. <laughs> Mr. Consistency, Philip Ball, we had a really good chat when you were training and uh, did you expect it to go like this? Uh, no, absolutely not. Um, I knew that I was really fast uh, in the strong winds or that I'm actually in this uh, time of the year and I was really lucky to have strong winds. Or that you can't. You can't tell me you're really lucky when you never finished out the top 10. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, I was still, I'm pretty happy that we had strong winds because it favored me a lot this time. And uh, I had a really good uh, second day. I mean, every day was pretty good, but the second day was two bullets. Uh, so did that help your confidence or was it more you just found your gear? Yeah, that's what I want to say. It's, it, it ha definitely helped my confidence and I had let's say, had, had my momentum going there on that day and uh, just tried to keep it. And it was never easy. It was never done like earlier. It wasn't done until the second race of the day. Um, so well, you, you uh, tidied the championship up with a race to, race to go. I've, I've been waiting here for, for you for an hour. Uh, well, we were, we were calculating it on the water and we weren't 100% sure. Uh, we thought so, but I just thought it's maybe better to... Just better safe than sorry. Exactly, yeah. And uh, one of the things you felt before you missed was the consistency. You're, you're not going to tell me that was all down to boat speed. What, what happened to your approach? Well, it's, it's really hard to say. I think my preparation last year, the whole, whole season was pretty good, I think. But I never could make it uh, like happen to have a really good result. Well, if you're going to make it happen, the world is a, it's a good event. <laughs> it's an absolutely good event, yeah. It's, so I, as I came here, I, I wasn't expecting like, uh, to be anywhere close to being able to win actually to be honest um, but then yeah as I've seen the forecast I've seen the first two days and then that made you happy yeah, that made me happy and I thought uh, maybe just just give it a go every day race by race and, uh, now and it happened. and the final day because obviously three races a lot of pressure and the, the results say oh how how did you deal with that as I said I just try to take race by race I think that's in general, any, anything or everything I can do, basically. And then I always knew that I can finish, I don't know, outside the top five uh, today in the morning. I mean, three races to go, there a lot can happen. So, yeah, and then I'm quite, quite kind of experienced too, so I'm in the business for quite a It's long. not your first world, I, I know that. <laughs> exactly, I think it's my 12th uh, world championship, so. And you've got really close before, haven't you? Yeah, I, you know, on the way in, I think I finished from fourth to second five times, I think. And uh, I looked uh, JB and uh, Matt, they've, they've had seconds as well. So, uh, yeah, it was a big, big tussle. Yeah, absolutely. I think the laser class is just incredibly tough to win the World Championships uh, in and uh, it makes it incredibly special. Absolutely incredible. And uh, I think that's the way you have to go. I mean, you have to, there's always only one guy who can, like, on the top and I'm very very lucky that I'm the one this year. I I don't think I'm gonna let you say lucky but congratulations Phil. Well then I'm happy. I'm really happy. <laughs> That's a good answer. So congratulations, enjoy your special moment and uh, I think you really really deserve it.